Amanda Lyons and I'm a math coach from the Special School District and this lesson is about foundational fractions. So the goal is that students walk away with an understanding that fractions cover the same amount of space and that they are shared equally. Okay, right, so everyone has their Play-Doh and everyone has their knife. So you're going to make a, bowl, a ball with your Play-Doh and we are just going to talk today about fractions. Fractions are part of a whole and so we are going to be making cookies today and sharing with friends. So go ahead and make a ball and then flatten it down into your cookie. The first thing you're going to do is you have your Play-Doh and you have your knife and I want you to think about sharing with a friend. So how many pieces would you put your cookie into? Four. For one friend? If I just, you and I just want to share a cookie, how many would you cut? Half. Cut in half. So how many pieces is that? Two. Two. So here's the thing I want you to think about. Is it nice for me to cut my cookie like this and be like, hmm. That's not. That's my piece? There you go. We'll share with you. It's not fair. So what do we have to do to make it fair? Straight down the middle. So straight down the middle. And then what, what will happen to the cookie? It both will be sides. Both sides. Yeah, both sides will be equal. All right, so now, before you start cutting, really think about this. What if you want to share with three friends? Cut it how, with three. How many, hang on, let me finish, and then you can say it. You want to share with three friends, how many pieces would you need? What do you think? Three halves. Three halves? What do you think? Three holes. Three holes? What do you think? Four halves. Four halves? Four fifths. Well, let's not think about halves. Let's not think about halves or thirds or fourths. If I'm just sharing with three friends, how many pieces do we need to get? Three. Three? So if we're all sharing. You get one, you get one, I get one. But that's only three pieces. We need four pieces. Four pieces if you're sharing with four or three friends. So let's cut it into four equal pieces. One, two, we need to make two cuts. So you're making two cuts. And then remember, once we cut it, to test ourselves, we're going to stack them on top of each other and see if they cover the same amount of space. And if they don't, you know what? It's Play-Doh, we'll squish it back together or make a new cookie and you can start over. I have my cutting side of my knife, right? If I use the back of it or the handle, I can really lightly draw on my Play-Doh without cutting all the way through it. Because here's the tough part. I am gonna ask you to share with two friends. So when you share with two friends, how many pieces do you need? Three. You need three. Why do you need three? Do you know? Because I'm including you. Yeah, you want a piece too. Yeah. So this is, it's tough, so you might want to try to draw on it with the handle or the back of a knife to get an idea of how many pieces, like how to get three pieces out of this. I need to help. I wish you'd think about it for a few minutes and try it. And you know what, if you mess up, we'll make another cookie. It's just Play-Doh. Mm -hmm. Keep going. What do you think? Yes. When you stack them on top of each other, are they equal? Yeah. Are they close? Yeah. And when you put them back together, do they make a whole cookie? show you a trick. When, and I'm going to use my handle. When I cut in half, I just go straight down the middle, right? Yes. And then when I had to share with three friends, what did we cut it into? Fourths. We cut it into fourths. That's when I cut straight across the middle. But now I only want three equal pieces. I need to cut somewhere. Let's change my cutting side. Somewhere in between the half and the fourth, if I go partly between there, I kind of wind up with this. Oh wow, that is cool. Circles can be tough. Let's try a different shape and let's see how it goes. We're gonna make a snake. All right, I want you to try to cut three equal pieces out of your, what we call it a snake but out of your cookie bog. Look at that approximation. You're eyeballing it. Nice job. Look at that. You're close. 
I think you guys learned something really important. Most of you want to cut it right in half, and you learn, like, I can't do half. I have to go a little bit here and a little bit off to the side. So what are fractions? Something that, or half of something that make a whole. So will we put them together to make a whole? So is this really a fraction? No. No, fractions are it's equal parts. It's uh, half and a quarter. Half quarters? There can be lots of different fractions, but they have to all be they all have to be equal. 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 equal.